Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we have the Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer Collection with ColourPop. I'm really excited. This palette looks so beautiful. This is perfect for every day and definitely perfect for the holidays. I'm going to take you guys through the entire collection, share with you guys my thoughts and swatches of the palette, swatches of the glosses and everything that's in the collection. I'm going to show you the swatches. So I am also going to take you on a tutorial on how I achieved this look that you guys are seeing here. I hope you guys like it. Now, now without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into a tutorial slash review. No, I'd rather be waking up with you. Set up alone in your room, slept with the light on, waiting up for you. Don't, I don't wanna be. Okay, so right over here we have the entire ColourPop Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer collection. And we're going to get started with the eyeshadow palette. Usually, to me, personally, I think that's the star of the show. So this is the palette. This is what it looks like. The front of it is so cute. It has Rudolph wrapped up in Christmas lights. On the back of it, it has little Christmas presents with the eyeshadow names in the back. Now taking a look at the inside, these are all the shades that are in the palette and you also have a pretty good sized mirror with Rudolph once again wrapped up in Christmas lights along with his little girlfriend. Um, but yeah, I really love these shades and I, I just want to show you guys the swatches. So right over here we have the entire first and second row. I was able to fit both rows into my arm and this is what the palette looks like and then right over here i'm showing you guys the third row i wasn't able to fit it along with the other two rows this is the darker row it has one shimmer and the other four are matte shades they're very intense colors and very pretty and then we have these cute lip kits it comes with one lipstick and one lip liner there's two different options for you to choose from and i'm showing you guys right here what both of them look like we have the darker lip kit and then there's a lighter one, more neutral. Um, one of them is called There's Always Tomorrow and the other one is called I Think You're Cute. These are going to be sold as a set so you get your lipstick and your lip pencil. We also have a highlighter. This one is called Jingle Jingle Jingle. This is from Soul Body. Soul Body is a sister brand to ColourPop. Um, this is the shimmery body powder in the shade Jingle Jingle Jingle. <laughs> really pretty highlighter. Also from Soul Body, we have the Humble Bumble Mega Mood Belt. This is a sweet snowflake shaped bath melt. This sweet snowflake shaped bath melt is the perfect relaxing addition to your add to your busy holiday schedule. It smells like cool mint and hints of soft florals. We also have a lip gloss trio. This is called Couple of Misfits Lux Gloss Trio. Top off your look with your favorite Misfits toys. Each shade features a sheer wash of color and subtle iridescent shimmer in a nourishing glossy formula and then last but not least i thought that these were super cute they're little ornaments this is a lippy scrub ornament and it also comes with a lip mask ornament they are both candy cane flavored yummy and then last but not least there are two adorable hair clips they are little antlers and little reindeer ears they're so easy to put onto your hair, but that completes this entire collection. Now let's go ahead and jump into a tutorial of using some of these products. I can't do my makeup without having hydrated or glossy lips. So I'm going to use one of these glosses from the couple of Misfits lip gloss trio. I think that's what it's called. I'm going to go into the color Dolly. I do like having a hint of pinkish on my lips. So this one looks like the pinkish color there is another color here i already shared with you guys the swatches so again i'm gonna go into the color dolly i thought that would have a little bit more of a tint let me maybe it's because i have like foundation on my lips right now hold on let's try it again that does look really pretty very shimmery not a lot of tint to it but it's pretty i'm going to jump into a voiceover using the eyeshadow palette now really cute packaging like i've already mentioned and i really love these colors so let's get started with an eyeshadow tutorial i'm going to start off this look by using the eye primer from juvia's place this is called eye prep eye prime i'm applying it all throughout the eye I'm going to begin by using the color Christmassy Time and applying it onto my crease area and just really depositing that color in there. I was really impressed with how pigmented this color was. I'm, I was a little bit worried about 
blending it out, but let's keep going and hopefully it all works out. To transition that color, we're going to use the color Little Buck and we're just applying it right on top of the green shade just so that we create the perfect transition shade. This color was a little bit more intense than I anticipated. Um, just like the last one, they are very pigmented eyeshadows and they are easy to blend. As you can see, they are starting to blend out really nice. This look is just looking a little bit darker than I expected. We're going to go into our next shade. This one is a little bit lighter. It's called Mush Mush and I'm applying it over the other two just so that we get a beautiful like light shade right here so that it just blends out really evenly. And just so that we do soften up these edges, I want to make sure I'm using a more kind of fluffy brush. And it's just going to really make it very soft when you use a fluffy brush. So that's what I'm doing here. As I was blending this shade out, it does look a little bit more on the lavender side. It looks very soft and I'm really happy with how this is turning out so far. Hopefully you guys do like the finished look. If you do hear my kids in the background, I apologize. I want to get this video up today. The day that you guys are watching it is the day that I am uploading, editing, and all of that. Y no se caen estos niños. Well, anyway, um, yeah, it's going to be launching tomorrow. So I'll have all of the collection linked down below in the description box so that you guys can purchase it. And you guys can get $5 off of your purchase using my code. I'm going to proceed with cutting my crease. I'm using the Juvia's Place Eye Prep Eye Primer to cut my crease. And my brush is going to be linked down below in the description box so you guys can check that out. It is very easy to cut your crease with this brush. After I have created the guide, I'm going to go in with a flat brush and just distribute the um, primer all over my lid. I do prefer to clean up the lid so that you don't get that color to bleed through because we have the green shade and you can see that right here it's bleeding through i normally do take off my makeup right there but my time was very limited i had to pick up my kids right after filming this so um yes just wipe <laughs> wipe everything underneath the crease off with a makeup remover i didn't but we still made it work and then once i have cut the crease already i'm going to go back into the color christmasy time and i'm going to apply it at the outer edge and really deposit that color so it looks a little bit more intense on that outer corner I'm going to be picking up my first shimmer shade. This one is called Misfit Toys. It's a very pretty pink color and I'm applying it to the beginning portion of the lid. And then I wanted to get you guys a close up of this shade right here. It's called Elf Practice. It's a green shade, but it looks with all my lighting. A lot of these colors look really washed out. So I wanted to get you guys a good idea of what this color actually looks like. So I'm taking this color and wetting my brush and applying it right next to that previous shade that I used called Misfit Toys. And I'm just creating a really pretty gradient effect. So going from that shimmer pink to the green. And then it's going to blend out into that matte shade that we deposited at the outer edge called Christmassy Time. I am pretty pleased with how this look is turning out. So next we're going to be going into um, my eyeliner pencil. This is the ColourPop BFF Cream Gel Liner. And this one is in the color Canopy. Once I've done that, I'm taking this color called Independent Together and applying it underneath the cream gel liner. And then we want to really intensify the outer edge. Well, at least I want to intensify it. I think this is just going to wrap up this whole look. I'm taking the color Ready Santa. That's the darkest shade from the palette. And I'm applying it to the bottom outer edge. And that basically wraps up this entire look. I'm just going to pop on some lashes and then I'll be back to show you guys the rest of the collection in action. So now I'm taking the Soul Body Jingle 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 Shimmery Body Powder and I'm applying it as a highlighter to the cheek. I don't want to say it's my favorite highlighter, but it's definitely really pretty and subtle. If you don't like intense highlighters and you like something more on the natural side and you have similar skin tone to me, then I definitely do recommend this highlighter. I'm going to be using the Rudolph Lip Pencil. This is the Rudolph... Um, lip kit there's two different ones there's the rudolph one and then there's the clarice one i decided to go with a dark lip today so again i'm using the rudolph lip pencil along with the rudolph um, lipstick the lipstick is not a matte finish it is um, a creamy finish and i personally do not like this type of finish because i feel like it just transfers really easily and it just kind of like if my hair gets onto my lips, it just kind of gets onto my face sometimes, so I just don't prefer this finish, but it is definitely a beautiful color. And then last but not least, we have the cute little ears, antlers. We're going to go ahead and put these onto my hair. They're super easy to put in, and um, yeah, definitely cute. 
All right, friends, that wraps up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and give my video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Let me know what your guys' thoughts are in regards to the collection and what will you guys be picking up. I'll have the link down below in the description box along with, along with a discount code so you guys can get $5 off of your purchase when you're shopping with ColourPop. Thank you again for being here and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Have you shopped with me yet? Go ahead and take a look. I have so many eyelashes, different styles to complement any occasion. I also sell eyelash glue. I have press on nail sets that I hand paint with love myself. I sell press on nail kits, which you can do your own DIY nails, or maybe you wanna sell your own press on nails. I have so much to offer on my website, so go ahead and visit www.sonadoraofficial.com.